I would not have served you well as a Noonday Ambassador if I did not share with you the story behind our gorgeous leather bags. So we partner with an artisan group in India called the Dalit People. And if you know much about India, they are made up of a caste system. So their social class system, depending on what family you're born into, that is your assigned caste. And even in 2020, it is very difficult to move from one caste to another. So if you were born into a particular caste in India, that would determine where you could live, who you could marry, um, what type of job you could have, and um, would really shape the trajectory of your whole life. And so the lowest caste in India, they are called the Dalit people. They're also known as the untouchables. And so they are the very lowest caste. And just being born into a Dalit family, you are considered unclean. Those families are forced into poverty and they only have access to the very lowest level of jobs. But this is a beautiful story of redemption. So while the Dali people are considered unclean, the other thing that's considered unclean in India is touching a dead animal. And so only the lowest castes in India um, can do any type of leather working or any type of work um, that deals with dead animals. And so, New Day Collection has partnered with the Dali people and given them a dignified job and a livable wage so that they are able to rise up out of poverty. But only individuals in these low castes can have access to these amazing jobs. And so what was intended for evil to oppress the Dali people is now being used for good and they're able to rise up out of poverty. And the Dali people, as I said, are given a dignified job and a livable wage and a healthy work environment. And it is very difficult for men and women in those low castes to find a job like that. So this is our modern leather tote. Um, this is our whew, this is our gorgeous workhorse. So great um, for a day at work. Perfect as I use this as a carry on when I travel, or if I just know I'm going to be out and about for the day um, and need to bring all of my things. Um, the hand, this is handmade, genuine leather. I wish you were here so you could touch it and smell it. But this bag is just gorgeous. On the inside. Has this really sweet lining and a pocket you can see the pocket and then um, an area here for your cards and keys something else that's unique about these bags is they actually use a vegetable tanning process so it's better for the environment and it keeps the leather looking beautiful longer also the artisans then are not breathing in harsh chemicals um, but something really special about our bags is that they soften and darken over time. So this bag, I've had, gosh, a little over three years. It still looks brand new. But then this bag here, I've probably only had for about a year. So you can see the difference there. Um, all bags come originally this light color, and then once they're in the sun, they start to darken and soften into this gorgeous color. So this is our rustic leather wallet. Um, the straps are removable, so you can carry it as a clutch or um, as a wallet. You can also wear it as a crossbody. It's really, really beautiful as a crossbody. Let me show you that here. I love, I just love this length. I love being hands-free. And then, wait for it, ladies. It is the classiest fanny pack that you will ever <laughs> find. Because ready or not, the fanny pack, the hip bag, the bum bag, whatever you want to call it, is back. And I just love the clean lines on this and just the 
really classy look. And so um, the strap just adjusts very easily. So you would just adjust it to the size of your waist. Then our middle size bag, which this is my everyday bag. This is our rustic leather tote. It zips closed, which I love. So nothing's ever falling out. And I have three small kids, so I need to do whatever I can <laughs> to try to keep them out of my bag. Um, and this actually has a really beautiful lining as well. And then two zipper pockets inside. Um, and again, I have had this bag since I first became an ambassador. So I've had this bag for over four years. It's still in incredible shape. It looks brand new if you didn't know what color it originally came. So again, this is the bag that's been in the sun the most because I do carry it the most often. So it originally came this very light color. And now just look at that beautiful, rich color. So I always tell people the bags for me, not everyone's like me, but the bags for me are an investment, uh, but they are a great investment. Leather is never going out of style, and these bags are so well made that they will last you forever. So if you have been in the market for a quality leather bag, I would really encourage you to give these a look. You are going to get... Um, a beautifully handcrafted leather bag, but you're also going to be fighting oppression in India and creating jobs for the Dali people.